Hello everybody, welcome back to another video. My name is G Games and today I want to talk about a topic recently that I have been seeing on YouTube that is um that vegan teacher. <laughs> if you don't know who she is, she is a TikToker who uh, makes videos about veganism and also um vegan related stuff. But real quickly, a little bit of disclaimer. If you are vegan or vegan in general, I have no hate for to that. Um, you can, everyone has their different diet, so it's okay. I'm just saying that this person specifically is just the, just a really worse person that I feel like should really just have, you know, some problems with her. But anyway, um, yeah, let's get on to the video. So I just want to say that, yeah, that vegan teacher, this person is just, oh my god, this is a roller coaster of content, but she is basically a person who on you on TikTok, basically, and YouTube, um, she basically, <laughs> she basically talks about veganism and um, vegan in general, but also is an animal rights activist. Uh, the stuff that she does is just interesting, I guess you can say. I mean, not. But the thing is, let's just... I'll just show you this clip here. Hello, students. We're going to be reviewing the work of Gordon Ramsay, who has 15 million followers here on TikTok. And I'm going to speak to you directly, Gordon. So, Gordon, one of the problems that I noticed that you have is you don't seem to understand the difference. So, as you saw, that um, basically that vegan teacher decided to, you know... Um, you know <laughs> basically tell gordon ramsay that um oh in eating animals is wrong um i would have vegan teacher are, are you okay look man like i'd rather eat my chicken nuggies with um barbecue sauce alone okay like i want to eat my chicken mcnuggies because they're yummy and they're tasty and then i like that i give major respect to gordon ramsay because he basically called her a vegan donut let's go gamers <laughs> but yeah um basically vegan teacher is somebody who tries to tries to tell people about how it's wrong to eat meat and it's best to eat plants but i feel like she doesn't understand that this is the internet and no one's gonna really listen to you about how um eating you know animals is wrong and stuff but um yeah <laughs> still um because like if you let's just like hypothetically say that like if we never ate animals then we'll just be roaming around everywhere so we we'll have to s still kill them either way to eat them and you know like yeah but yeah another thing that's been happening also as well but that vegan teacher that she recently also uploads a lot of um you know videos in general and stuff that like it's just so weird so here's a couple of clips i'll show about that Bella? By God, please save this dog. <laughs> you watching me drink my smoothie and you want some too? Okay, let's go give you some. Pineapple, celery, soy milk smoothie. Yummy in Bella's tummy. This woman looks like a mop. I'll be mopping the floor with, not gonna lie. <laughs> And yeah, as you saw on those like three clips that I show you guys, that damn this this bitch just holy crap, yo look at the top line of her hair, it looks like a mop. I would be using that in the, like my house right now, be mopping the floor of her head. Huh. She would have no more hair because of that. But still, either way, like I feel like this is just some kind of thing she's trying to do. I know she's trying to force or maybe like at least give some chance for people to be vegan. But she doesn't understand that some people have allergies to some certain type of food. It's it, 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 are, are you OK, ma'am? <laughs> like people have allergies and sometimes they can't even go vegan because of that. And that's why some people have other stuff to do. Like, I, for some, sometimes, I eat salad, okay? But I at least put some, like, I don't know, like, carne asada or put some croutons there. If you don't know what carne asada is, it's, um, cooked meat, basically, in Spanish, but still. Um, I would just put that on my salad and just eat it in peace. And I don't understand. This, <laughs> this woman's just really weird sometimes. Um, 
another thing is that she also maybe even did something to um say that like oh if you eat me oh you're, oh you're gonna gonna go to double h e double hockey sticks area if you know what i mean and if you and if you don't you'll go to heaven but that's that that tiktok just just why it, it, it scared so many kids like come on like john robert bell actually is a really good guy i'm not i'm gonna say it right now and i swear that guy does better stuff than um this basically because he actually educates his viewers and i feel like that vegan beecher needs to know some stuff if 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 you know what i mean but like yeah it's just like i don't understand people just have really issues about this and it's just yeah i think i also have some issues with her right now um I feel like mostly the majority of TikTok kind of hates her in general because it's just why and um why in general but uh yeah uh my god sorry if it's a little bit too edgy or like complicated to say but I'm just gonna say right now that like yeah that vegan teacher is just <sighs> but yeah some other videos that she's done as well is about the LGBT community. And I feel like the that vegan teacher and about talking about that is just like, huh. I'm just real quickly going to say that I have no hatred to the LGBT community in any way. I'm just saying um, that this vegan, that vegan teacher basically is just not the best. And I feel like I should have her account deleted or even just get a suspension. I don't fucking care, but still. I'm just saying that vegan teenager just has some problems. So, um, yeah. I do know that I have actually been recently watching a little bit of her clips. So, here are some clips that I can show you guys to tell you that there is some issues with her. Three, two, one, sing. Eating animals is wrong. McDonald's hurting animals is wrong. McDonald's share this song and change your entire menu to be vegan from now on. Kale, tofu, lentils, beans, peanut butter, banana, rhyme, peanut butter, banana, rhyme. And as you can see here on those like two clips, I guess, um, yeah, she's basically been just doing this, and it's just why. I mean, she doesn't understand that people aren't really gonna listen to her. Like McDonald's, the corporation, I don't think they're gonna listen to her just to change your whole freaking menu to veganism. Like, why? Just, just in general, why? <laughs> It's just some stuff that I don't understand that, like, vegan teachers just have, it's just some, I don't know, like, person on the internet that, like, a lot of people are using as a punching bag, I guess you could say. She's, like, a running joke, except that she gets older every single time. Yeah. Plus, I don't know why, but, um, even her dog has some issues, and, uh, yeah. And I don't understand about that, but, like, it's just really weird. Plus, she even tried to make her dog go vegan, and I feel like... <laughs> Does this bitch doesn't even know that dogs are supposed to have a healthy diet with meat? Because plants could technically, like, even kill a dog because of that. And I feel like that's, like... Like, for me, from a dog owner, I have my own dog. His name is Rocky, by the way. Uh... Yeah, I feel like there's just some kind of certain, like, why? Just why? I, I mean, I hope that we can, you know, save her dog. That's also named Bella, by the way. I hope we can save her. But, um, yeah, save Bella. <laughs> Mission one, save Bella. Repeat, done. <laughs> but, yeah. So, basically, yeah, that vegan teacher is just, like, I feel like as a as a person um, right now, it's not the best looking for the vegan community. And she's just basically just putting out all this, like, misinformation, maybe. And I feel like it's just weird and why and ha. Huh? And, yeah, like, bitch, I just want to eat my McDouble and chicken nuggets with a side at Burger King with onion rings as well. Because I want to eat some nice, like, steak, maybe, medium rare. Mwah yummy it's chef's kiss but yeah i i <clears throat> just why i do hope that um you know this gets resolved soon uh, maybe at some point but uh yeah uh, <laughs>
but yeah anyway i would just say right now that um i would highly appreciate it if you guys would subscribe to the channel um even leave a like even like the video as well that actually helps a lot we're cl so close to 100 subscribers so uh this would really mean a lot if you guys would you know subscribe and help me out a little bit so um yeah um i do hope that you guys had a great time watching this video if you guys want me to do another video like this about like some topic that's just been on my mind recently then um tell me down in the comments below and also um type type down in the comments below chicken nuggies because you know we we like ch we like chicken chicken nuggies mm -mm, yummy yummy so uh yeah anyway um thank you guys for watching this video i hope that you guys have a great time um and yeah remember to eat your chicken nuggies and eat spaghetti with meatballs bye bye guys